Remember when that was a thing? Matt Fraser showed it once on a video and I think half the CrossFit population bought it. Was included. Real simple evening of bodybuilding. We did some front squats earlier. Underhand grip pull-ups. Really, really like stretching the lat as much as possible, keeping those arms narrow to help my overhead mobility. 10 controlled dips, five rounds, that's it, 100 reps. With the dips, I'm really trying to fully go to like that proper end range because we're really like stretching that pec and shoulder. It's kind of like the same thing as the snatch, you know, like that end range strength. That's why you see a lot of weightlifters do dips, heavy dips. Post workout, ball blade. You're training now. You are. This is what I love about life. Look at this little face. It's like having your own little Pokemon. Currently we're training our Pokemon to play ball. And it's a Pokemon that can follow you, like Pikachu. That's cool, isn't it? Just taking a front seat for the... Bloody hell, as if I got a free ticket to this. Yeah, buddy! <laughs> what's, the Ar what's the Arnold one? We've been watching the Arnold documentary and that it's one. actually... No, no, it's the shelf, isn't it? Bloody hell, bloody hell! Look at these! Look, Look at that shelf, babe! And, and that one, isn't it? Look at that. That's how I look when I bloody jerk <laughs> from the other day. <laughs> Carla, sit, sit. Good girl. Currently at the moment, the weightlifting cycle that I'm on is four days a week. I've done that one to like look after my nervous system, but also two means that I can go heavier on those days. Less volume equals more weight. But it also means that a couple of days a week, I'm aiming for three days a week, I'm just gonna run. Why are you doing this? I just felt like running. Bank up 20 to 40 minutes of running, and I'm gonna see how it affects my lifting, my fitness, my recovery. Real simple today, one minute on, one minute off, 40 minutes. 20 minutes of running for me, 20 minutes of running for Jazz. Keep a good pace. Start up slow. And this is what this is like, so, <laughs> get this. Um, get this right, that when you have four days on, you have two days off at a time at certain points, and I didn't know what to do with myself. So this two days off today, it's just like a bit of cardio instead. Then we take a full rest day tomorrow, and my central nervous system should be flying on Friday for some big clean and jerks I've already seen. If this hits bullseye, we're not doing it. Didn't even register a score. I think I'll speed up over the intervals. I'll take the first couple and just like more. Post Malone and the Kid Leroy and Luke Combs are the three best artists I've ever seen live. If you ever get a chance to see them? Five K. Just over 9k in 40 minutes, I'll take that. 
started off at like a 4.30 kilometer pace and then ended up around four and then the last one was just like 3.30. Let's take a look at the whoop data. I reckon this is gonna be a lot of zone four and five, even though it, I don't know, it didn't feel like it was. But my body is not used to running. Why are you running? Thank you, cleaning brigade. Cleaning brigade. I was doing like five, five ten. It up to like halfway and I was trying to do like between 4.14 and 4.20 and then the last two rounds I was like 3.54 I was like please don't pass out and fall off <laughs> I was just staring at the guttering like don't fall off So we've got a swimming pool team because we're famous <laughs> What the f*** are you doing for? <laughs> I'm getting in! <laughs> Really swore on the vlog. <laughs> We're back home and Dad's outside with his cap on backwards working. Look at this nostalgia. He is covered. Oh my goodness, what? If I just stand here, I wonder how long it'll take him to uh, realize I'm here. He's just looked at me and ignored me. My name is Jeff. He is into his jet washing today. Man and a jet washer. Up. It's like um, it's like a petrol one, really high-powered thing. But I had to put my hat on because I was burning my head a bit, you see. It was going a bit red, so I had to put my hat on. You need a shower. <laughs> I think I'll just hose myself down. Jeff and a hose. Jeff and his hose. Oh, Great oh. friend. <laughs> You're taking me to see a, a local let thing that's been put play. up at the park. Let the children play. Huh? <laughs> you. A giant child. So you've got, you know, your leg raises, you've got your sit-ups, you've got your, your little bench press. So it's something out the Kama Sutra, this is, you know. What, Dad? <laughs> this is a strange one, isn't it? So you can, you can, and then you've obviously got your sit up you've got your pull-up bars, which are good. Taking my dad out for the day. <laughs> We're doing what he wanted to do. <laughs> right, there it is, my new gym. Leamington Spa, my hometown. The only other spa town in England is Cheltenham Spa. No, it's Bath, isn't it? What was it? I don't know, maybe there's more. Town, yeah, maybe there's more. But look at this, beautiful. What's this statue, Dad? This statue here outside the town hall is um, a statue of the late Queen Victoria. Um, the story has it that a bomb fell around here and the blast of the bomb, it actually dislodged the statue. So it's, well, you see it's sort of leaning slightly to the left. Look at it. The statue got, got dislodged after she died. I know that that's... But it's hanging off this side. 